Okay, hey BMW N73 engine lovers, you guys with your 760s and your 760 LIs, the V12 motor. We're looking at the um, exhaust manifold off of the passenger side, and I found out something kind of interesting. When you look at this thing, you think, well, hey, it's just a log manifold, right? It's not very well flowing, and all the exhaust comes out here and just bangs into the wall and has to figure out how to get to here and go out, right? Well, it's not that bad. And I'm going to show you what I found. Now, this one, of course, it goes in and then it curves around here, okay? So that's a no-brainer. This one, you think, it kind of goes in and it could go this way or it could go this way. But if you reach in a touch, there's a wall here. So if I was to show you from the top, they've actually, like, welded a wall from here around like this that curves the flow of the exhaust so it comes out this way. Then it's open. Now the thing they did not do was on these two, they did not put another wall here as well, I guess, even though there's tons of room. But it's interesting, so they go to all the trouble to put this wall from here around like that, and on this one, around like this, in order to flow this, and so these two at least get decent flow in this direction. This one, they, these two in the middle, they just kind of go bang, and you know, it could go anywhere, and then it has to find its way out. But I thought that was pretty interesting that they've got this whole thing going where go in and then you're actually touching a wall and then my, the tip of my finger is actually touching the edge. I can feel the sharp edge right there where it stops. And this exhaust gas has to go in, through, and behind that wall to get around here. So it's kind of like a little bit of a, almost like a tubular header but not quite, built inside this huge stainless steel shell. It'd be kind of interesting to just take a saw and cut straight across like this and look at it, but I don't want to do that. The only other thing I could think of from a flow standpoint is some of these welds are a little thick. I don't, you know, whatever. I suppose you could grind them down and polish them a teeny bit. I'm sure it wouldn't do a thing for your performance, but that's um, a close-up of how the uh, N73's exhaust manifold is made that you don't normally get to see.